This one. There you go. Good. One, two, fifteen, three, four, five. Swing off two. Six. Swing off two. Seven. Bring that knee up. Three more. Two more. Bring that knee up. Bring knee up. There you go. One more. Bring knee up. Good. Thank you. Okay. Yes, that's going to do the same thing. Turn them on. Pop, 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 pop. I want to hear that. Thank you. You see, uh, you gave up. You lost faith in your arm pole. Okay. Oh, drive. Uh, try to get hit like somebody with your elbow. Go, go, go. Okay. When you're in, hold that breath. Go. Pop, 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 pop. Thank you. Yes. You hit, if you hear that, that means you're not using your arms properly. And the more time you spend on the ground, the slower you run. It's like the ground is hot. Oh, 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 oh. Drive the elbow back, the hands to the back pocket. Okay, on you. Take a breath. I want you to hold that, hold that breath all the way through the finish line. Same thing. Actually, if I'm, if I'm holding my breath, driving my arms, and keeping it, I'm gonna pop off the ground. And my lift, my legs are gonna come, my knees are gonna come up. So I'm gonna get that all the way through. Take the breath and hold it. Don't let it out until you get past the finish line. See, I'm going to explain to you why your body does what it do when you lose focus. <laughs> so you take a deep breath and you hold that breath. You hold that breath here. You don't hold it in your chest. You're going to tighten your stomach. Keep your stomach tight all the way till you get past that tree. Okay. All right. <laughs> that means you can't control your happiness. Happiness is going to get finished. That's what you want to do. Take a breath before you start, you want to go. And then hit it. Take, pull it, pull all that in. Get that breath. Pull, 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 pull. Whoa, I skipped one. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I'm trying to let you see? Because you're striving to strength. That's why you did that. Not because you, you didn't win. But your arms now are making you, uh oh. Yeah. My stride is lengthened now because I'm supposed to get happy. So I can keep establishing that, that thinking process. Just snap, snap. Good. That's why I like that. Come on. Yes. 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 Come on. Yes. Yes. Come on. 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 Come on. What you feel. It's good. Now, you hold your breath. You don't breathe until you get past that tree. You go. Man. You can hold your breath for 10 seconds. This thing, if I can hold my breath for 10 seconds, my right hand's gonna come across the sternum, no further than this. So when I come off the turn, my body's gonna think it's gonna snap. That means gravity, yeah. legs come through. See, now if you were, if you were just to lift the legs a little bit, and not use your arms, say, do that at the same time. Like, say, from here to that second tree. And put your knee to your body. That's it. Five laps. That's all. That, I like that's what I'm going to Give me five laps. Just five laps. Love that snare. Nice. She's been doing this since she's two years old. Doing the bronze. You know what she's looking for. Yeah. 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 I'm running, so with my, I'm running with my phone. This is going to be so much sense. sense. Who has the Lakers, Juju? Woo! Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Woo! 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 Woo!
I know track season is ready to come up. If Also, if you play football or you're doing any conditioning for sports, um, y'all can go ahead and give them uh, a holler. Um, so first thing I want to ask them is, when did you start running track? I started running track when I was in fifth grade. You start running in fifth grade? I ran a 60 meter dash and I won with street clothes and street shoes. Because my mom was taking me shopping and we saw a track meet. The guy came over to me and said, would you like to run? I said, okay. And that's how my future started. Right, right. What are some of the things that you can tell some of the parents um, that you can suggest to them why private sessions is good before they go and um, work, go to practice at, like with a regular coach? That's a good question. Most of the times when you have individual training sessions, you can individually check out and critique the athlete. When you have a group, it's difficult to single out the individual and work on their glitches because everybody does not run the same and everybody has a different body composition. So therefore, you have to improvise your training methodology to meet that person's individuality and creativity. Most of the things that I've seen is breathing and arm action are the most important part, which was a great benefit of why I became number one and two in the world and ran over 10 years and didn't fall no lower than eight in the world. Man, that's beautiful. What's some of the countries you've been to? Oh, I've been to every country, every continent you name it. I've been to China, Russia, Europe, South America, Australia, Japan, Tokyo, and all those places. And, and track opened up that opportunity for me to travel, which I could not have done. All right, what are some of the uh, places in Arizona that you have coached at? Uh, right now, I coached at Major Community College, where we were number one in the nation in 76, and then 77, we were second in, in Junior College National Championship. Uh, I coached at University of Maryland, which I had produced a Nehemiah, not only Nehemiah, which was one of the best herders in the history of track and field, and he still has times that very few athletes can run back in 1980 and Merlin won the ACC, and I also coached a little bit at Arizona State, and now I'm coaching at a school called Copper Canyon, which I'm trying to develop that program. All right, that's awesome, that's awesome. So if you guys need private sessions, they're $40 an hour, any location, go ahead and tap in, y'all. Thank you. Peace. <laughs>